I think science and technology is really amazing because it helps us answer two really important questions. What's going on out there in the world and what are we going to do about it? After spending thousands of hours at sea following sperm whale families, I've learned a lot about what's going on out there in the deep ocean. Sperm whales, like the famous Moby Dick, are animals that form lifelong relationships, that babysit for each other, that have family traditions passed on by grandmothers, and learn local dialects. They have different ways of life that resemble our various cultures, some which even coexist in multicultural societies in the Pacific Ocean. These are animals that live rich, complex, and interesting lives that I think many of us would be surprised to learn about. And it's science that has taught us all of this. But what we learn from doing science and developing technology also makes us ask, what are we going to do with all that knowledge we've acquired? Dr. Sylvia Earle said that if there's no blue, there's no green. Every second breath you take comes from the oceans. Without the oceans to act as the blue lungs of this planet, there would be no life on Earth. My parents' generation used science and technology to put people on the moon and robots on Mars. But this generation, my generation, is going to be about ocean exploration. My name is Shane, and I'm a National Science and Technology Week champion. And I think you can be one too.